told her that I thought the tweet did not go far enough, that I thought there needed to be a call to action and he needed to condemn the violence. And we were in a room full of people, but people weren't paying attention. And so she looked directly at me and in a hushed tone, shared with me that the president did not want to include any sort of mention of peace in that tweet. And that it took some convincing on their part, those who were in the room. And she said that there was a back and forth um, going over different phrases to find something that he was comfortable with. And it wasn't until Ivanka Trump suggested the phrase, stay peaceful, that he finally agreed to include it.